Hello everyone, my name is Tony and welcome to the channel where we're going to kick your Excel skills into higher gear. And in this episode, we're going to teach you how to highlight cells containing uh, formulas. So it is nice to have that tool whereby you can distinguish between hard-coded cells, that means like cells that just have some type in numbers, as opposed to a cell that contains formula that's derived from an uh, aggregate of cells. So let me just show you what I mean. I've got this basic table here uh, depicting my sales. Uh, it spans over the four quarters and gives a total. And I'm tracking two managers' sales here uh, independently as well. So what happens is you can see in the formula bar, this is hard-coded hard numbers. So they are not highlighted. But where we have uh, a formula, like it has the sum of these four figures here, uh, that will have a highlighted number in the total as well as the sum here highlighting the quarters total as well. So I'm going to show you how we're going to uh, create this nice feature whereby we can highlight cells containing a formula. Alright guys, so I'm going into the sheet here, I'm going to start from blank and you can replicate this table uh, to follow along. I'm just going to put in some random numbers here in quarter one for my managers. So, and in quarter two, let's put in 500. I'm just gonna take random amounts here. Oh, what is also nifty, you can get uh, manager two, you can say equals rand between, and it will generate random numbers. The bottom number being, let's say 50, and the top number being 500. Close the brackets, and you can say enter, and you can drag the formula, and it will generate random numbers, just as a, a nice tool, but now, we can use Control and uh, Control C to copy the figures. Control C because it will always randomly shift these numbers. And you say Control, uh, we can say Home and paste special values here. It's a space special values, so it will be hard coded. Otherwise, it's going if it's going to contain the formula, it's going to highlight it as well. So that was just a quick one. Uh, if we go to G3 here, yeah, we're going to just click Auto Sum here. You see Auto Sum here in the right hand corner. If you go to Home tab, Auto Sum, it will automatically pick up. We're trying to sum the four values that's adjacent here. You can say Enter and you can drag down the formula as well using the little handlebar, dragging it down. And here in quarter one, we're going to use the same. We're going to say Auto Sum. It's picking up that we want to sum the quarter uh, one results and we can drag the formula to quarter four and now we're going to have a nice total but now the purpose of this uh, tutorial is to show you how to be going to highlight highlight a formula uh, cells as opposed to hard-coded cells so it's quite easy you just highlight all the cells you click on the little uh, drop tr triangle here to select all the cells you hit Control and g to go to the go to uh, place here a go to pro prompt and we're going to click on special. So special is here on the left hand corner. And we're going to click on formulas. And it's going to highlight the numbers, text, uh, lo logicals and errors. You're going to say OK. And it's going to take you to where formulas are uh, within that range that you selected. And now we can highlight it. So you can say we're going to highlight it to this nice green. We're going to take the text to white. And we want to put it in a bold as well. And there you have it guys. It highlighted all the cells containing formulas and effectively we could change the formatting in one go or in one sitting. I hope you really enjoyed this quick tutorial. Remember to hit this little uh, subscribe button, hit the like button if you like this tutorial and I'll see you for our next one. Cheers guys.